Hello guys, welcome back. In this video, let's explore Crease Edge tool in the Blender software. But before going into that, I have got these two mesh cubes. So I'm going to select these mesh cubes and apply mesh smooth to it. So I press Ctrl 3 to subdivide it uh, three times. Generally, when you have this modifier here, you could see the subdivision has been uh, put to three levels. So I can generally uh, press Ctrl 1 also to get the smooth level of uh, 1. So I'm using the third subdivision level. So the both models here got the same number of subdivision level, but they both gave completely different result. And uh, if I generally see the uh, result, okay, um, the result is based on the lines what we have added here. So this model has got no lines, but this model has got, you could see the lines on the corners and that area is becoming round from the edge where it is actually there. As there is no middle line here, so it became round completely. So every time to make this kind of uh, models to uh, the bevel cube in this case uh, we have to uh, add lines there now we can work on the other way around so i'm going to press ctrl 3 for this model press tab and then select few of the edges here so i'm going to press 2 for edge mode and then we have this tool called uh, edge crease or you can use a shortcut of shift e and then when you drag it and uh, when you release this okay then you should be able to see that corner has been achieved there okay so it's not uh, becoming round it's maintaining that uh, corner now if i uh, switch back to the edge and then press shift e then you can actually uh, remove this uh, crease there just by reducing the value okay so i'm going to select all of them okay i'm going to select all the edges and then press shift e and then drag it and you should be able to see that nice uh, you know drag uh, where i'm getting this bevel uh, based on the value of the crease there okay so i can release the uh, cursor there and just click like that and then at 0.393 i got this corner and if you want to remove the crease there okay then what you need to do is you need to press shift e again and then you can slide it inside or drag it inside in the direction of this arrows so in which direction the arrows is going you can drag your cursor in that direction and you can remove the crease okay so this is a great way to uh, achieve this uh, beveled corners uh, for your model however the mesh uh, is basically uh, equally divided here where um, i mean the the lines are not concentrated here they are equally divided through the model however this method is more uh, useful way or more practiced way i can say crease yeah you can rely on this method too 